Hey guys, it's me, Christina, with Mystic Spirits, and I got a few requests on showing how, um, asking if I can make a video showing how to use, um, the, uh, sticker makers. So, I'm gonna show you guys real quick. I wanna try not to make this super duper long. Um, I'll start with the little one first. Let's move these out the way. Okay. So, you got the little ones. Um, you can take, you know, like I have this sticky notepad. And you can pretty much use, like, you know, any small things. These make, you know, little s stickers up to, I think, one and a half inch. So, you know, you can take you off a sticky note. Make sure I'm on cam. Cut out your little picture that you want. Okay. And then, all you do... And this cartridge right here comes you know, out, and you have this right here. All you do with this one is, and you want it wherever you want your sticky stuff to be, the back, you place your picture up, and you just drop it in there, and then you make sure it's pushed down in the right spot. You take it. And you just pull it out. And then you just pull it up and tear it off. And you'll have this little plastic piece on here. All you do is take this and pull it up. And whatever sticky is not on your picture here. Let me go on this side. Whatever is not on your sticky here, like whatever you didn't want your picture to be, the sticky, the rest of the sticky gets transferred over to this. So you just blob that up. And see, there's no sticky on this part. So then once you get that picture, you want to cut your picture out. Nah, this is probably going to be horrible cutting, so I'm trying to do this fast. I'm using my duct tapes, the scissors I use only for duct taping. So, <laughs> couldn't find my other pair. I have like 50 million pairs. I have like, I don't know, I guess I'm weird, but I have like a pair of scissors for each thing I need. So I have a pair for paper and a pair for fabric. And, but, and then you get, there's your picture. And it will be difficult to get, but if you can find you a starting point. on your sticker Ooh, to drop it. you get you a starting point and you just peel the backing off and I'll just use my hand to stick it on and you have you a sticker so that's how and you can you know you can stick these in the way you want but I'm not going to stick this anywhere because that's permanent. <laughs> um, so that's how you use this one. And then, you know, it's easy for a freaking five. I think the age recommendation is five years old. So, but if you're going to let your five year old use these, be sure you don't have. Focus. Be sure you don't have. Well, that says um, the permanent. So be sure you don't have the permanent. And. I haven't tried refilling it yet, but I know how, I think. Um, because I read the instructions. <laughs> but um, to refill it, you have these little things here. Well, let me see. See how easy it is? You just push them together and it falls right on out. And then you take this one. Make sure this is facing up. Uh, this is up. And you just slide it right back in. And you're ready to go. That simple. So if you you know you want to switch them out, and what's good is if you want to switch it out, like you want to make some permanent, but you still have some left on your adjustable, it don't matter because it's still. It's not like you have to use a whole roll up before you can change it out. Okay. 
So the next one, and this one's gonna be kind of difficult because um, I think I messed the cartridge up in this one. So I ate my new cartridge for Friday. Um, because the cartridges for these are ten bucks. Um, but there's the cartridge, and I think there's like on this back here, there's supposed to be something back here to help this wheel turn or something. I don't know. But um, so all I do is just use my fingers to pull it out right now. Um, but you can take you. Like, if you're going to make bigger stickers, or you want to make um, several at a time, you can print you some out. Or, you know, line, you can line them up. Like, you can line them all up along here and push them in there. I'm just going to cut these two out and show you. It's too big to go that way. So you just push it in here. And you're supposed, the way you're supposed to do it is be able to turn this knob and it just pulls it right on through. Like I said, I think I messed up the cartridge up, so we're just going to pull it through. But it's the same pretty much process. Pull it right on through. Pull it up. And see, now I have to get the tweezers in there to get, and you have you one big sheet. And you do the same thing. Pull this plastic off. And then you can cut that out. And with pictures like this, of course, you know, it'd be hard to get a detailed cut. So, this is just the way to make more than just one at a time. I have my one inch hole punch. And you can just take your picture. I don't want a little more of that, so I'm gonna trim this down this way. And punch your sticker out. And you have you a sticker, which I'm not gonna peel this one off because I'm gonna save it. So I like that. Um, so and then here, it's bottom close. Same with this one. See, I want more. I want more in the thing, so I'm gonna trim it down. picture and you have you some stickers it's focusing yeah and see you have you some cool looking little stickers um and then if like if you're gonna use these in something like in resin or anything like that I don't know, I haven't tried it yet, but if you, um, you might want to go ahead and, like, coat the backs before you run it through the sticker and let it, like, coat it with something, but, um, you can use Mod, use Mod Podge to, um, coat these in, say if you're going to use them in resin or other things, you would coat it in this to protect it, the inks from bleeding. And, um, I think once I, when I start doing it, um, I'm going to coat them first and then run them through the sticker maker. That way I know the paper is coated on the back with the layer of sticky stuff too. So that's just to show you guys how I, um, how these work. Um, I think they're amazing. So, um, yeah. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, any comments, leave them. Any questions, ask them. Um, and sh hey guys, I forgot to show you how to <laughs> um, refill these, uh, the bigger ones. All you do is you have this little lever here. You ain't got to pull it up, you know, a whole bunch, but you just pull it up and 
pull this out. This comes out, and so your cartridge will be this big. But you just pull this out. And you take your new cartridge, pop it back in there, and close your lid. That's all there is to it. Okay, see you guys later. Bye.